one more thing we want to talk about before we move on to some other things mm -hmm. is Doulas. Doulas was a part of a, um, Scare Doulas, Them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but even since Scare Them kind of, you know, mm -hmm. go them way. You know, Doulas is a part of my thing. Right. Doulas is a part of my thing. Bigger yeah. than Scare Them. Mm. Yeah, man. Doulas are a brother, man. Doulas is one of the most significant partners in the whole journey. journey of music. Yeah, out of all of the person that me come up with, he had the most significant help and support. Yeah? Yeah, this, the type of support that Doulas give me musically. Yeah, man, the amount of song with Doulas right, whole heap of song Doulas right for me. And the, 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 the depths of them, you understand? Because mama is not in a good mood, yeah. and Doulas come up with that. You understand? He write the whole chorus and then me do the verse them. And then book, 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 Doulas right from the intro. Everything. All the intro. All schoolers rip from this. Can I see anyone who do that song? You know, <coughs> Batman to get it on. No, and I do me never want to do that. I just never really think I did much that read him there too. Oh. I mean, these things are like book book song for them on a one drop thing. I never think say, oh, you have to sing a book book on a dance and I go like a whole vibe. But you are the right thing. Because you can't send a message in a boring farm. Mm. It have to say joyful. You know? Yeah, so it just came out perfect. Yeah, yeah man, but do last yo. Endless song. Me, me can't remember how song Doulas right? Yeah, Doulas is one of the big support in the music. Yeah, Ellie good? Yeah, man. I want to make to him. Mm. Yeah, man. Ellie, I want him a great, great soldier too, man. May I try to find him? I can't find him. I like. I'm going to find him for you, man. <laughs> 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 I'm going to find him for you. 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 Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> you have to talk to him, but you don't do film story. No, 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 no. And the people have been asked with the answer. Yeah, man. And you, you know people are still there. Yeah, and them, them say Ari, and them say Boom, and them mm. say Me, and them say Coach, them I want, yeah. You yeah. have to come talk to him, part. <laughs> man, I make him come in, man. You have to come in. Yeah, man. Do that, man. Yeah, I boss the keeper. But you say that, mm -hmm. you do it, you know. Such is right. Where are you now, bro? You have made mention of, you know, missteps that you have made along the journey and things. Mm -hmm. I mean, and you, you said something you have to do that. stick with me, say, mm -hmm. man, do less than you and worse off than you. Yeah, true. See? And what me never am I guess you don't feel like I'm or something. She got to go tell the people about these things, but it could not be proven. Right. That if that. I am a somebody, if you use a hammer hit somebody, there must be some blunt drama or some bruise yeah. or some swelling or something. And then it was days after we went to court and no man where I heal. Come as a coat. If you been beat you with them, you can't wear eyes. That was the same on. girl where, when you're the content spring and you get the one call, you call her. No, I, saw this, I saw the report. No, 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 no. If, say, if, if it was the same allegation. The same, <laughs> the same I allegation. Know, I remember, so none of that never proven it. Right, <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was that case, yeah. Right. But I never did that. That, that never relevant. When we would call her and I tell her that for like me, I eat them. Me, I want the same thing. How stupid them on. I mean, no, no, but I case them a bill still, yeah. love them still. I said, God, then that's why I'm going to tell people what people am them, but them can't prove it. Yeah. But I said, God. In 07, there was another situation where there was a report that you pointed a gun at a off you with the police officer in New Kingston. You were all that a foolish man. Gun charge, jam, assault, wounding charge, and all that or something. That case was thrown out. Yeah, all of them something never thrown out. I lie, but tell you what, it's just that they never really know the other two persons that used me as a, a tag. It was me and Ice and Bigger Five. A Bigger Five beat up the half duty policeman and Ice threw any scene in my face. But you needed to ask them friends yeah. and the man that know them. The man said, so Bunty kill and him friend do him all these things. But he's not me and my friends. But me him use as a scapegoat for catch them. Because him never know who want him in a fucking him just know a bunty kill and two men. Mm. So he said, Bunty kill and his friend. But that happened to him, but I don't mean it. But he did have to say it that way if he catch them. Because if he not implicate me, he couldn't catch them. So when him do that, me have going and said, No, that man and that man was there. And Ray, 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 and me have to tell them one who do it. Harm me, I forgot to take it. I mean, I've got to take no blame for nobody. Mm. In 2000 and 2010, it was a rough year for the killer. I got, I got, I got detail a few things. Mm -hmm. That was the year with the case with, I think, Raquel is her name, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. That was the year that your visa was revoked. Mm -hmm. That was the year when tax administration the took vehicle. the Range Rover, <laughs> Range Rover uh, uh, Land Cruiser. Uh, yeah. And we had the 2019 and uh, 2009, better make 2010 rough, so. Mm, it's a blessed year, I guess. It, <coughs> all these lessons and blessings came. Yeah. I don't know. 
Yeah, it was a rough period, man. And then lead on to that right up to the last time I'm on. Yo. Right. Some rough, rough years. period in your yeah, time, in, a, in, a, yeah, in a the journey, in the lives. Yeah, last few years. Mm. Last decade was the most rocky one we ever had. Yeah, last 10 years. <laughs> rough, 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 man. Nothing we have to endure about the life. Yes. And interestingly, though, Killer, out of that, out of those trials and tribulation, for the people who have been following the journey would have seen a bounty killer that was cross, angry, and miserable become a little bit more mellow, become a little bit more polite, mm -hmm. less guess, aggressive. Yeah, man, but you know. Are them struggles that kind of help you talk, brother? I guess, you know. I'm humble, you know, because tell you what, life humble anybody, you know. And we learn along the way and tell you what. Experience teaches a lot. So I guess the experience that we've been through, you just show me the, the reason. You don't need to be cross and miserable unless it's necessary. Yes. I don't work with the burden. I mean, I work with the burden. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I guess mama did there. I try and push it. <laughs> keep me on point. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> also, some people have made references to the fact that, you know, in the late 90s, early 2000s, when Bounty mm. Killer speak, you know, mm -hmm. it's a different killer now. Far more articulate, far more eloquent. Yeah, because as a man, you're growing on, you learn more, and then you have more sense of things where you say, I know people that react, you know. One time I don't say anything, and I really think about mm. But now, I'm not going to say things certain way, I'm going to consider yes. and more. Consider it and think of other people's feelings too, you know? Yeah. So, we don't really try to offend people anymore. Yeah, we don't want to offend nobody. We just want to defend mm. somebody. <laughs> we defend the people. Yes. We don't offend the people anymore. So great has been the killer's growth where killer is now guest speak at different forums. And <laughs> <laughs> there was a situation where the Minister you. of Culture, I remember, brought you on a forum where it was for, for some abused people and people were kind of, you know, say kill up, record, suggest X, Y, and Z. But you okay. went and you delivered, brother. Yeah. Even the Minister of Security called it once. Me right, Ninja, with man. Ninja. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that's good. That's a good, that's a good look. Mm -hmm. And these society have some acceptance. For the hardcore youth. <laughs> for the hardcore youth. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> We could talk about a few more songs them now. We can't talk about all our songs. That don't make no sense. We True. talk about some of the major crossover songs them. Mm -hmm. But a whole heap of other songs um, out there where we don't, we don't talk about songs like Cellular Phone, we don't talk about mm -hmm. um, Walk This Boy and all of them songs there. More girl and <laughs> the works. Yeah. Summer Breezing with Diana King. Yeah. That did well. Yeah, man, Summer Breezing was a great one. That was a song from her album, I think. Yes. Yeah, that was about 2003 or 2004. We went to Miami and did a great video. It was a great experience. Mm -hmm. That's the first time working with Diana King. One of, awesome vibes. Yeah, one of the money that has stuck with you is Poor People Governor. And that would have come out of songs like Poor People Fed Up, mm -hmm. Look Into My Eyes at Any Time. Yeah. All three songs were banned. No? Mm, I'm sure. So poor People was Fed Up was banned. Sure, poor so. People Fed Up was banned. Look Into My Eyes was banned. I'm sure so any time was banned. Sorry, three of them was them. banned I mean, then. Possibly three of them, yeah. Yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. you know, or, or you detect that, because some man will get upset, but I think no. that when you ban a song, the biggest song. No, yeah. When, yeah, for a long time, you know, so when they ban the song, you get more attention. Yeah, so when them people ban, curious. I like when they ban song. <laughs> and then when you ban song, it don't really do nothing to the song. It only create more attention on the song, because right. you can't lock people's ears. Unless you can't turn off people's ears, you can't ban song. You understand? But the song I go play and people still are go hear it. So when them band the song, them it never offend me. It's always kind of hype me up. I love when them band the song, them because every song with me know you mean band always get bigger. Always a bigger song. Man. Always. Any time a song every, band, every time. it get bigger. Mm -hmm. So I always think that band the song is a good thing. So I never really take it no way, but it always weird because poor people fed up. Never had no profanity. 
Right. I understand. They look into my eyes through the line. I said, the only friend I know is, is the, the yeah. Have. You understand what I'm saying, but I understand why you would have want to take it the other right, way. Right, right. But poor people fed up. Two of them system shake up. They should go and feed them. If you listen to it, no, have no profanity or anything well, derogatory. Against the, 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 he does the, speaking against the system. Right. So it shows that you know why you're not, not against the system. And if it's in context or not. Mm. So the, that was the only discrepancy me have. Why you would have banned poor people fed up? I can't not say nothing. Me understand when you say, anytime in nine, yeah. So it was, me still I wonder if them did ban poor people fed up with you. Because me, me I wonder if I hear, me did hear that or me see it in the paper. Oh, that's what you say. Yeah, but that never makes sense. That's stupid, man. And that, and, and, and tell you what, them ban other songs like that too. Songs that speaking out for Again, certain thing on the behalf of the people, and it now nah, said nothing derogatory or profane. So it wasn't surprising. Mm. Cause how much Bob Marley sang them, I like to. And Bob Marley not saying anything right. more than that, what supposedly right. said. Yeah, so. At the system that they have to understand, and I feel them radio station, I know our one. Those three <laughs> songs, like many of the songs, will live forever, brother. Because yeah. the system will remain the system, and True. you know what thing go. Classics again, man. Mm hmm. Poor people fed up, look into my eyes. Anytime. Two biggest piece of social commentary. Anytime as well. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you also, throughout the journey, brother, have many, many collaborations. Mm -hmm. the, the better I person would be you know? who killer not collaborate with. No, I love Marcia to collaborate. Marcia Griffiths, Anthony Red Rose, I love Pinchas, to collaborate. Sanchez, Beanie, Merciless, Cartel, Sham, and then it's mm -hmm. Richie Stevens with me and mm -hmm. um, Pat Mama and all of them two in the red. Most of them. Yeah. Do uh, will ask me to coach you, scare them the works. I love to collaborate. It, it's good. It, it, it drives my talent and push out more. Uh, yeah, when I work with other artists, it, 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 it bring a different side. Yes. Plus all of the international collaborators, we talk about Noriega and mm -hmm. Jeru with the damage and the whole works. Is there anybody in the business where the kid, you work, you collab with all Junior Gang and, and all of them man? Is there anybody in the business where you, know, where you know, do a collaboration with Rodney? Where you don't mind do a song with one of them time? Oh, who would I really work with? I mean, I work with them. Who would that be? Who work with all of them? I really, really don't want to work yeah. with still. With, with basically everybody. The only person who I really want to do a real song with a Shabba. Shabba? Mm. Me and Shabba the pan song, but not really a bounty call, a bounty Shabba call. Calab, yeah. okay. Yeah, but those are the significance of me looking up to him, I idolize him certain way, and we come from Seaview Garden, and yes. it would have been nice. Mm -hmm. But just me and him, one on one call up. Yes. Mm -hmm. And mm. to the similarity with style and, and vocal, vocal. Right. Makes mat. sense. And I two columns, then, brother. Yeah, man. Perfect. As simple as that. People would have loved the collab the two. <laughs> yeah, Bounty Killer, Jabba Rankin, mm. that's the collab that missing. Yes. The ultimate one. But we had a song, but it's not me and him. You understand? Mm. We had a song with Steve Marley and Junior Gang. You have gotten many awards, many recognition. Yeah. Yeah? We know the Super Bowl thing was, I mm. think, being and the Grammy, no doubt situation. Yeah. Your own nomination for mystery from Get a Dictionary. So you would have gotten an award at Jerry and all sorts of places. And yeah, and the Moon Man, the Moon Man. TV Moon Man, yeah. Out of all of them <coughs> things there were, you attain award like which one of the one, which one of them is is, you know, get the greatest joy. Well, Award is just award, you know. I don't really have none of them more than no, that they they the same already. significance. Yeah. Yeah, but. I mean, knowing you, I know that you want to tell me. Them, me. them have the same significance, but them have different recognition still, you know? Yes. As a Grammy Award is really the award. Right, you know, right, right. More right, than right. a Jerry Award. But a Jerry Award means more to me because the people who gave me, they are the ones who helped to mold me and they know exactly there. what me stand for. Yeah, they have more significance to me. 
but didn't get more recognition than a Grammy. But yes. Grammy don't mean more than my Jerry Award. My Jerry Award mean more to me because them people eh, are giving it for the right reason. Mm. Grammy, I just give me a Grammy through the people that are popular at the moment. They don't know what I stand for. Just popularity them I work off and not significance, you know? Yes. But the award is just an award to me. I don't really I don't care about award. Yeah. We spoke about the growth of Bounty Killer earlier, and one of the things that you have taken on in recent times is the Bounty Foundation, mm -hmm. which I have first an experience of because I'm practically yeah. everywhere. Yeah? <laughs> and thing. how that kind of come about? Well, the, um, charity or something with me. Been doing, been involved in charity over the years. Always help and try to give back, but it was recently when I brought the beds to try. For KPH yeah, and Jubilee. We, we, we had problem with duty. Customs. Uh, yeah. So we found out that you have to have a foundation registered if you want to get exemption for mm. duty and them something for bringing stuff, you know? So that is what really drive me to from the foundation but i've been doing this my first set of charity i think i'm 95 the first time we got donate money i think a mobby or a glendevan me and louise and jammies mm. louise fraser bennett yeah, yeah man. man big up louise r.i.p mama here yeah, i think that's the first time i'm gonna give a twenty thousand dollar each to two school that's how my thing started yeah and from this you know we always do back like a charity thing, Saga to the East was one of the part proceeding aids. Right, okay. And that was where I went and gave the money before the concert. Yeah? Yeah. The only concert that would keep part proceeding aid and the money give before the concert. So if the concert never should happen, yeah, they nah, would still get the money. Yes. It wouldn't really proceed from the concert. So we always do them thing there. So it's really banking push me now so we have to get the foundation if we are gonna try to import stuff because mm -hmm. we have to pay a duty pan stuff or we are gonna give it. Yes. So that's how the bounty foundation was farm, you know, and it's going on good. We have made a quite quite a few presentations yeah, so far. And we are looking into the tiger situation yeah, recently. Man, we spoke about that. Yeah man. We are looking how we can do, where we can assist him. Mm. So that will be our next step to assist Tiger. Yeah man. A good step that. Yeah. One of the things though, killer, you know anything you do in life, people you will have people saying good and people saying bad. You know some people so are saying if you do things to people, then why <laughs> you have video it on them, something. Yeah, but why why not video it? Why you don't want to show others to do good when you are on or, or you get things to continue and you get people to encourage to do things, you show them. Mm. And tell you what, most of the goodness we doing is see we see other people do it. We saw other people doing it. What do you think I'm doing a foundation? I saw other foundation. So I'm showing people the foundation that I'm laying. <laughs> I'm not trying to get a prop summit or trying yes. to show up for anybody. I'm just trying to get people to encouraged to do it. So you don't want to do it. That's why I feel disgusting to you. The people who loves to do these things are gonna be excited about seeing it. Yeah. So all the people who feel away when them say people are giving away, you them not give away and them don't want to give away. So them don't want you show them up, so them not give away, cause you are give away. You understand? So I don't understand why people that see me and help people and I say, why me a video? Then you know should have glad you are seat. Me a video because I want you to see it. I want you to see the goodness. I'm sharing the goodness. <laughs> I'm sharing the good news. I'm going to do that share, brother. My camera exactly, that's what we do. Brother. We so, share the goodness. We <laughs> spread the joy. We only want a banky call me and say, teach. Well, Why not? If me can reach. <laughs> God, that's some weird times. <laughs> Kaboom. Watch it out, bro. Yeah. The latest money car we kind of rest on you. King of Kingston. <laughs> the last album you did was Get Out Dictionary. Yeah. 202. Yeah. That is almost... 19. Yes. Almost two decades. <laughs> Good you have been working ago. on the King of Kingston for mm -hmm. over a year now. For a while. Mm -hmm. You know what? I did this summer over there and tell me that I come this summer. Man, I'll take you up and do videos and kill the album and come out this summer. So. <laughs> <laughs> How far is the album from completion, sir? Well, the album actually completed, you know, but chub why? We have so much talents and so much thoughts and ideas for this album. So, like a double. It is again. a double album, yeah, man. No, this album is going to be nearly 50 track cars. They must have made that thing. I'm going to put. 40 track, but no, true next year, my 50th birthday, and like next year the album will come out. Come mm. tell you December, but right. I'm not gonna force it, I'm not gonna rush it. 
it looked like it might turn 50 track for the 50th. Because next year is my 50th birthday, so. Mm. It looked like it's next year the album will come. Like, I have an idea some of the work, but do already still, but it looked like. I will it's a massive. It. No, it's a massive, man. Because the track list, so we, we, we release and the complete track list, that, that's just most of it. Mm. But there is more track to come. Yeah, man. Over 30 odd collaboration, it's not gonna be normal. Well, I think it's well, yeah, kind of in terms of the visa situation, kind of, you know, yeah, I never motivated yeah, and they motivate me a bit, but it kind of hold up the vibes now. I can only <laughs> imagine that there would have been significant financial fallout from you not being able to travel to the United States to work. Well, I won't even imagine the amount of millions I would have made, but it's just life, I mean, I'm not worried about that. When me not make on my one, I'm going to make a colleague on my one. When you not make on my one? one. No, I'm not talking about could have or what me have. Mm -hmm. When me should have and could have, I know what me have. Yes. And what I have, me I deal with right now. You know, so this is what I have right now. Jamaica, I'm a freedom, I'm a good. <laughs> I'm a good health, I'm a free, I'm a dad, Jamaica. I'm a dead on the chamber ready for fire again in America. Mm -hmm. And that day going to come. We're not stupid. They, they, they can't have me out all the time. What do you mean? They have to give in. They so have to give in. The, the tax situation would have also put a dent in the, the financial aspect Most of Most definitely, thing. man. Then America, the whole of the work, the man, because what you know, we got England and then with the four show, but we got America and with the tour. Mm. You understand? You stayed there for a month, and America is the biggest music market. That's where the music is most big. You understand? So everybody know, not going to America, Big financial dent. But man only buy bread alone. <laughs> they have one breed and I eat and I live, man. Yeah. yeah. One of the things, as I said that, one of, I remember watching an interview with Pantherson one time. Yeah. And Pantherson said a bounty killer is responsible to make artists can earn sensibly off a of a dub plates. And give that credit there. Well, we kinda groom dub plate in a, in a lucrative business still, yeah, because over the years. We run doubly like a business, you understand? Yeah, and then uh, we do dub extremely well. Some people don't do dub good. You don't have the GVT and the vibes. Yeah. So, on a every dub plate, worth. He said that in an interview, he said that the quickest man and sharpest man for the dub. No, well. and then no, a dub plate boss me. So I'm a good dub plate artist. I'm a dub plate artist. Because <laughs> dub for dub was one mm. of my first, ago. you understand? And the Mega Jam is an arrows, me learn how to do dub good. One take, no mistake, call the sound name properly and pronounce the man's name right, call them something there, have a lot to do with the dub. So, me is a good dub artist, so people invest a lot in dubs with me. So, when I'm not doing shows, like now, we're not traveling, dub plate is one of our main income. Yeah, because nobody not pay for a card. I record now, say a little statement, and I come and I have much money, you know? Yes. So, a good thing we did do a good job. So, that's a good. <laughs> Speaking about statement, Rodney, mm -hmm. you know, yeah, you watch the interview them, and you would have realized that many of the artists that I interview, mm -hmm. one of the, yeah. the recurring theme is that, you know, them struggling with them royalties and publishing. Mm -hmm. How are things? Read that with you. Oh, well, my publishing are very secured. <laughs> yeah, that's one of the things where we did. You saw the Secure business part of the early, business. Yeah. Well, me did get a little dent mm. in the early part. Yeah, Gussie and Jam is them, and I know dub plate music, I'm something rich, you know, but dub plate music, it must come by your statement too. Yeah, them did pinch out a little piece still, but I'm good at Ooh. this stage. Yeah. So in the early part, we get a little dent, man, but we come and balance. catch up and learn the thing, yeah. Mm. And then now recently you see me and <coughs> mm -hmm. the recent one with Concord. Right. Mm -hmm. and Car, yeah, them, them kind of, yeah, man, I was there. Yeah, so Creative Titans and Concord, them secure everything now in all region. Nice. Exactly. So mm. my pension is safe. Rodney, you have been doing this from nine from late eighties. Decades now. Mm -hmm. Decades. Over forty plus years. <laughs> yeah. You have been through the different changes of the music and all of them something. Along the journey, bro. Yeah. What would you say is that single thing when you look at it? It makes you proud of knowing where you come from. You just want to hear your voice on the radio and what you have achieved now and contributed to the music. What are one thing that when when people say it to you, or you hear it, or you think about it, it gives you a sense of accomplishment. 
What would be that? <laughs> what would be the one thing now, brother? I can't uh, put me, uh, The love of the people. Uh, it would have been helping other people to feed them family. I will that would have been be the love of helping other people. It would have been helping other people. That mm -hmm. would have been the most significant thing I've yes. seen how much she help to help others, you know? That would be the most. And the love of the music too. Because mm. I, I don't think I can stop the music. No care what kind of business or success me have, me think. Music. I still have to go and uh, say something. I have to rhyme. I have to rhyme. <laughs> yeah. Mm, yeah, me have a rhyme, me have a shout, me have a, me have a sing. Me can't do nothing and I do them something. Yes. Even if not for money, for the pleasure. We have to do the music. Music have to in my bone. Mm -hmm. Me can't stop singing. I mean, I must perform, but me but have to sing. You have to sing. Is there anything from a musical perspective where the killer not achieve it, where I'm still hope to put him finger up on the something? Mm, musical achievement. Why no musical you not achieve it, right? Or what's significant? I mean, I think there's nothing more for me to achieve in music. If me achieve anything else, it's okay, but me don't need nothing else. Because mm. I don't need a Grammy to validate my music or my impact in music. And a Grammy has nothing to do with how good the music is or how much of an impact. Bob Marley have a Grammy? No. Okay. So, I'm good. <laughs> so, he don't need nothing else then. Yes. No, I don't have nothing else to validate mm. my value and my reason and my impact. Looking at the journey, Father Price, mm -hmm. is there assessing the whole journey? Is there anything that you think you do differently? Or you do anything when you say, Jaja, you know, so I shouldn't do it that way. I don't do it that different way if I get the chance to redo it. Hmm, what would be that now? What would I do different in music today? I don't think I would have done anything different in music today. I think mm. I did everything correctly. <laughs> you did everything correctly, so no yeah. regrets, so not at all. I have no regret, because I never want to sign nobody for make a dollar for them. Right. So I don't think I would want to go back and do anything different with who I help or who I bring. I think I did it right. I did it right, right? Yes. Yeah. I'm happy with my, all my achievements. Mm. It would be very difficult for you to answer a question so what your favorite song. I'm gonna have a million <laughs> songs. Yeah? But I, so. tell me about the five songs that are the most important songs in your career. Well, my five favorite bone to kill will be Mama Not in a Good Mama Mood. Mama Not in a Good Mood. The basket in the kitchen running out of food. Poor people fed up. Mm -hmm. Book, book, book. Look into my eyes. And the Lord is my light and salvation. Uh, them, they are my favorite one thing. Your favorite killer, them. Yeah. Of all the, the crossover songs, the, the overseas collaborations. Oh, which one would be my favorite yeah. of all of them? Yes. Mm, it's a party. It's know? a party. And it's just a love of the people from love with the people show for the song. Mm. It's not the most successful song or the most selling song, but that song, anytime we go in the parties and they drop it, the people say, Yeah, we're ready now. It's a party. This is the party. Yeah, so the impact, and then I never know I could have simple lyrics. Party going on from night, night till day. day. For me, never know I could have teach you them simple things, they'll mash up the place. So that teach me a different dimension of music. Yeah, so that's my first party on them. And till this day, nearly 30 years, it's still a rock, you know. Still a rock. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is there anything the killer love enough other than music when we then do for good food on them family table if I never have music? <laughs> Well, me tell him, he's a hustler in a youth, so I nah, <laughs> nothing special about him. Nothing special. Do, you know, man. And then he'll come to hustle him, he's a hustler, you know, but if me never do music, where me would that, you know, now? Well, before me that do music, me that do figure and with that. Yeah, hustle up and streets. Well, if me never in a music, well, me that take figure to another level, still, me know that. Oh, you like that? Yeah, something with me a passion for, man. Something we will love, making figure so if we never read the bust in the music, that a woman would have put my head to. And then me no one would end up a do if it don't work. Mm. But that is what we would be doing if we never burst in the music until music take me, you know? Yes. Priceless record label. Mm -hmm. That's still active? No, as I told you, I just build a label did for bust my friend them and I never really trying to become a producer, producer. prominently. Mm. It's just because they never have access to labels. I just made the prices label and the scare them production 
for really bust my friend them. So after them buzzes, we never really continue with production. I don't even know some of the tape them there right now. Or the hard drives or whatever. I mean, I the master them. them and them something there. I can't ever find them. Because mm. most of the tape them... They're really not just in there for two dead ones. You can't tell me the tape them, they, 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 they cake up and we have to carry them down and dynamics go, or tough can go beat them and... Some of them they get destroyed. We try to recover the, 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 the mm -hmm. material. Bigger boss, you have been around the world. Yeah. You perform many, 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 many different places. You have been way out there where when you, you hear say you have to go to work, you have a different energy. You look forward to the show there, to the <laughs> country there, to another part there. Mm, well, we look forward to everywhere in about tell you one. Out of Jamaica. A Brooklyn I place here, yeah, man. Yeah, no fire did they not did they say man? No, you see Brooklyn, as I tell you now, is a significant place to me because I just first I think Kappa Kappa shot, shot, take off. off and then you gotta have a son named King Adiz mm -hmm. that came along as a bounty son and then from a place named Biltmore Ballroom in New York. The histories of the sound clashes. Yes, yeah, so when me go up Brooklyn Total different vibes. That's like when we got Tivoli at Jamaica. All right? Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, man. Is there anywhere where the killer not going to march down yet when we for going another part one of them time? Africa. Uh -huh. no, Any, Africa anywhere yeah. in particular, in the country, yeah, or just, anywhere just in Africa? Africa? We just want to see Africa now in our time, you know. Full time now, you know. Yeah, man, we can't wait 30 years of career. I'm not going to Africa yet. Mm. What the hell is happening? Africa, what are you No ramp with me. I'm ready. You go walk back in all. Yeah, man, sir. Mm. Africa is the only place me really need to go right now. Yes. Yes. Me Kill the fans. The whole I bother with them from Ansap, Sling Thing, Duck. Come right through. Yeah. You have a rhythm where I don't want the showtime, the whole of them. Bug, Diwali, and, and, and anger management, mm. million rhythm. You have a rhythm where when I hear that rhythm, you just want DJ. No, the body suit him. Put on everything my body suit him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Put on everything my body suit him. Blip, 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 blip. No, really, nobody like put on everything, man. No. They said, no, really, nobody like put on everything. Put on everything my body suit him, brother. Mm. <laughs> Bow the clash. Bow the clash. Ask Ninja, man. I ain't gonna tell him. A 300 song in Vice Pump Put on it. It's a 300 song Pump Put on it. Body suit him, that bitch. <laughs> Six o'clock. <laughs> what I was that? About three o'clock? <coughs> mm. no, about three days, what I interview this though, man? Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a boy for both things. I'm not a boy for everything I want to interview this. <laughs> Show me the answer. I'm not a boy for everything I want to interview this. Alright, ready up? We know that Doulas did a lot of writing for you. We know Carter did some writing for you. Mm -hmm. We know enough man kind of not like to talk about writers. No, I like to talk about writers. No, no, I, like, I like writers because some boy are a pirate and I'm a thief. Mm. People write them thinking you and you want to look like it's you write it. Why well, you want to do that? Don't take people props. I'm the one, man. me are the only big artist where I like writers, you know? Yeah. You don't know Buji writers? No. Okay. And you don't know Beanie writers? Well, I don't know about Gringo. All right, can Gringo, come out, come talk. Beanie don't tell people who write songs. I'm the only man who come out and bring out people as writers. And why you hiding it? And tell you what, that's why we are more versatile than them. Because our things tweak and it it it, it and push. And on one direction and on one thing. Hold on, me a fatty now. know. How me and go sit down and meds like a 25 year old youth? Me have to get people who are 25 year old to sing for that. And bring me on that level from what me can bring back myself to 25 year old and that would be living backwards. Mm. We're supposed to try to think like 55, not 25. You understand? So we have to get people to write on the level of the younger people to make my son sound relative. Me now go try to think like 25 year old. Me go get a 25 year old to think like a 25 year old. That's how you do it. Yeah. You understand? So me have a different direction when me take my music and then the people them who help me to write them, help me to tweak my style and keep it modern and evolute me. Because when you hear me, me no sound like 1990 straight. You mm. sound like a man from 1990, but me no sound like 1990. Me sound like the man from the 90s, a DJ in the 21st century. Yeah. So that's why I use other writers. And on this album now, Omula do come back with my whole 90s thinking and come try to get 20 year old picnic for dance. Yeah. 
that's not going to work. So me get young people, we refresh the young people them with the arguments. So other than, I like, saw so we know two of the major ones, which is Dolas, we know Cartel is some writing, but mm -hmm. is it Flex wrote for you too? No, Flex no. never wrote this okay. one for me. Is there, you know, any other name where you can say the money or that girl Dave here? Kelly. Dave Kelly, one of my great writers, look into my eyes. Mm. What this boy? Can't believe my eyes. And another level, all of them big bad songs. And Dave Kelly write all of those. Yeah, so Dave Kelly are one of the main writer. Yes. You understand? Know yeah. And Cartel write a lot of songs too. But Doulas write the most songs out of all of them. Yes, yeah, so Doulas is one of my major writers. Yes. Over the years. You have been in the business <laughs> for a long time. You have seen different changes in the musical landscape. Yeah. Is there anything wrong with the music today? Anything where you say, yo, you know what's that? That's something they need for change. That need for fix. Yeah, man, a whole heap of thing wrong with the music, man. The music is being destroyed. Well, from my perspective, one of the major problems, people don't rate talent anymore. Mm. Talent don't make a difference. I mean, I understand what kind of people listen to music. If talent don't make no difference, don't need music then, no, man. If we don't have talent, we don't have music. Because <clears throat> the disc jockeys, them not care about talent. The selectors don't care about talent. It's all about eating our food and making our money. You may understand that, but where you make the money from, you know, and preserve it. Yeah, I can't you know, making money. If music is the much about you're going to make money out of tomorrow, and the people know what it is, it's just everybody just think about me and eat. Me a hustle, me a eat a food, he eat a food, also thing. Yeah, so the pay all the thing and the money pull up something, it, it make people not think about skill and talent. It's a thing about me a eat a food and me a make a money. So that help destroy the business and the people them know where I'm coming out of music, where they don't know about the music, because they don't study the music, because you have some artisans and producers. What on a list when you now go become producer and DJ? Because the artists them now <coughs> who influence them. Cause Kian Bunty, Bojo and Beanie and Terra Fabulous and Mad Cobra and all these people cause we wanna sing say and the type of music wanna do. A piano music, foreign music, soft music. Dancehall is becoming soft music. Fenke Fenke music. Drum and bass gone. The biggest downfall of music is trap. That's the biggest downfall of music. Cause we used to have our original sound and now we don't have one. Our music cannot be identified again. But people out there will say, Rodney, the music has to evolve. Yeah, but I'm saying everything has to evolve, but evolve in a good direction. What is it? <clears throat> Are every change good? No. And every change good, brother. Sometimes you're better, you remain as you is more than run, go to fool in it. And that's what's <laughs> happening in dancehall. We are fighting so bad to find something new till we now have nothing. Car watcher, we have to evolve, but only when we find the necessary step to make. Why we are going to force to make a step and chip up? The music has to evolve, but we don't find the sound yet. So better we go and stick with the one we're good until we find the next good one. But on a trap. And a trap. And a trap. We don't find it yet. Keep searching. Don't stuck with that and think you find it. Yes. We don't find it. So that's just the problem. We have to have a loot, but we don't find it yet. So we are, we are searched it. We in the zone. May yes. understand. For the young artists, then we are emerge. If you were to, you know, give them a word of advice, what, what would that be? Well, the man them need to study your genre and your feel of music. You can study soca and a dance all you do. Study your thing. <laughs> and the youth, them we are do our thing. Now nah, study our thing, they must study some other thing. They must study the, the, the past players and the founders and the pioneers. They must listen to Jamaica music and they must do Jamaica music. I mean, I understand how you do that. And then dance all is not a language or an accent, it's a sound, a beat, a music. So you can't play a trap 
and then put pot up on it and call it dancehall. No. Dancehall is a beat and sound and music. Rubber dub. And some pot word. No. The beat, the sound, that's the music. And then the lyrics and the culture come on it. But nowadays the people in this put pot up on anything and call it dancehall. Mm -hmm. You got your part where you sing a dancer. Yeah, dancer. <laughs> After the crop of modern artists that we have, we know that being a Bonte, Bojo, Shaba, Cabra, Ninja, them and their giants. Columns yeah. in a day. <clears throat> yeah. Is there anybody in that current crop where you look on and say, you know, so that you have a high ceiling and 20 years down the road, 30 years down the road, them are going to view him like they view a, a Bounty and a Beanie? No, I can't tell you that. We can't see that right now. No, I can tell you no lie. The, the commitment and the hard work we put in, I don't see nobody else I put in that today, man. Man get three songs and say, I run the place down. Man not no courage and man not no, 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 no time to build, but... Mm, good artist, daddy. <laughs> but I couldn't pass. Busy and assassin and I don't know. Not no out there, so I'm gonna see them are gonna be like a bunty and a beanie. Mm. The closest would have to be an assassin or a busy or a elephant, them type of man. But them youth they're out there, so they're not doing this story. They're not work so hard. They don't want to be this big neither. No. Oh, they don't want to be. They don't want to be this big. No, sir. First thing, they never make an album. They don't make albums. Lone right singles. now, from what they and me make, everybody coming at the album. Spirit, you know, from what they make, because I make album. Everybody I make album in a dog. So you kill and I make album. So <laughs> I have think so me bring them into the vibes, because they don't even make albums. <clears throat> so you don't even get a good body of work of them if you can analyze them, think we know how good them is in depth. Yes. Yeah, so. Them have to go and evolve themselves, though. Mm. But if they want to get to this stage, how will it work, Virgin? It's not easy. Yes. Them have to start work from now. Back in the days, Rodney, Bada Clash, Sting, Sunsplash, Sunfest, mm -hmm. Saddle to the East, Champions in Action, Island Explosion. We not only Sunfest we have left, brother. What no, the music dying, man. Live music gone. And then, but that's that real music, you know? Yeah, well, you know that. Yeah, Jamaica have the music again. Because the concert's not there. Live music, outdoor music, mash up in a Jamaica. And the government don't like music, boy, and either. This is how they want the country locked down on them something. They don't want no music, boy. Yeah. So it's really the government or the people, them do. The, the government, government and the sure people, both of them. No, but and the people don't keep sure. The government now give the people and the, the leverage to do it. Here, yeah, because police come lock up people show to you, know, brother. When a man pay a kill a million and pay how much, man? Millions and millions and millions and police come lock it up. Me say, me got a uh, St. Mary come from in a, in a, in a, in a arena, you know. And police come lock it up to work like, you know. In a arena. In indoor, you know. It nah, this time, nobody ought to do, you know. And it's a part proceed in aid to the people that sent me, you know, Cape Town Show. Yeah, man, yeah, man. And, and a mass camp. Things are going till a man in out of the door. So, okay. Yes, so that's what the police them do to the music of Jamaica too. Fight the music, wicked. Yeah, I mean, I mean, understand how that go until this day, them lack of St. Mary will come from in a indoor arena, two o'clock, and so I go on a mask until four o'clock. Till this day, I, mean, I understand. Mm -hmm. So that's why most people now want to keep sure Jamaica too. Yeah. Mm. I remember whilst I was at the, the Bounty Foundation thing for Junior Biles. Yeah. You were having a conversation with Big Stone. Well, you know, me, I'm not normally there. I, I go on, listen to I go on. Yeah. And you were suggesting that the music need like a union. No, it Or need something it. where artists contribute. Exactly. And in at the end, if anything go on, because we have seen many situations yeah, man, where many artists situation. kind of hit some yeah. patch and... True. So why... Kill and help. Because the man influence great, you know, Rodney. Why you not try? Not you for do it, you know, but try to get some of the man them where we listen to a killer face. No, I mean, no time for that, you know. I can't do my thing solo. Okay. Me, you know, me can do whatever contribution me can make. That now goes really up so easy, and then people have to go consistently do it. 
because if you stop paying your dues, uh, the thing might fall away, you understand? Mm. So, I mean, I don't support you then take on. No, I would take on, but I would support it. Yeah, man, I would support it. It's a good initiative. I would support it and I would be a part of it. But I would not want to be the organizer of it. Mm. You know, no time for that. But I would want to be a part of something like that. Yes. It's a good initiative and we should have it for true. Yes. And we we will continue to suggest it. And hopefully we can get it off. Something like Jerry or something like we have to have something for the artist then. Mm -hmm. Jamaica artists as much as we don't know. Something. But we have got to have something. We have got to talk about it, Richie. That something has to be done. So Louis Fraser Bennett never used to run something like that? No, it no. was sound system ah, association. Sound system it wasn't for oh. artists, it was for sound systems. But it's, it's similar, like Jamaica Arts Association is yeah. similar to something like that. Yeah. Yeah. But know, it's a good suggestion. Mm, I know that only very few sound men out there would probably have difficulties getting dub plates. See? But me not, me not, cause people link me. Enough man link me and say they want to kill a dub plate. I'm telling them to link Steve. But mm -hmm. the people out there want to get in touch with dub plate. How them reach you, brother? Well, it's all different ways to reach me. You know. It depends who you know around me. Mm -hmm. But the proper way to reach me is to contact my manager. Mm -hmm. You understand? Make sure you find somebody who you know is really Yeah, because you, have, you guys are, are dealing with something Yeah, because well, like people that scam recently. and whatever, something. So people know that. So if you don't find out so these people connected to artists, don't send me money. Mm -hmm. You have to have proof. Yeah, because the one must scam the people in hard still. But anybody who want to contact me for the play, them know. Find Mr. Rudy or you find Banky. Mm. So there's a number for Banky out there, Rudy? Well, Banky number is on my page, yeah. Okay. 876 452 8075. 876 mm. 452 8075. It's on my page also, and the email and everything. So people want to go give other people their money. Well, not my responsibility. That's a perfect way to get to us. Do it the right way. Yeah, are you link teach them and teach them and link me? Sure. Either way. A regular <laughs> man, they reach out. But yes, but I'm man saying if a man link them teach them, teach them, we give them my number yeah. or teach them, we give, give them, them somebody's number. number around mm -hmm. me. Yeah. Properly. Father Rodney, you know, we can't sit down and do this for the whole day. No, we have to do the <laughs> extension. But because this is just the first clip. <laughs> Before I go any further, though, let me take the opportunity to say that whilst you have, you know, paved the way for many entertainers in the business, what I am doing now, you played a significant role in that. Yeah? And I know yeah. I don't want me to seek out a use of the thing and say the thing different and the thing just click. Yeah, man, I show a natural mystic, man. No, your thing you would, man, tell you. I mean, see, it does feel rich and it does feel different. Yeah. And then now, uh, see that? I was so right. Look at, look at the equipment, look at the, look at the woman attire, teach them. Logo. Them no more than we. Them no more than we. No no we we shot me reading on brother. You. No, no, the we platform is so far. We read so far without the endorsement of the killer and the love yeah, and the respect. You understand? You do it, you do it, you do it properly, and you not take no side step. You are go forward, man. Don't the thing serious. The people them love the program. Teach them. I appreciate that, brother. This brother. is really an uplifting program. And tell the same news. First thing on a review you're doing on you, they give them news in a real man. information yeah, in a man. The school man. I love that channel, yeah, man, and the people I love it too. And this interview, you know, long missing them across your feet. Every I'm day. Glad, man. I'm get this, guys. <laughs> Every day. 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 Yo, I said, yo, ah, what are you going to do that for me? I said, oh, I tell him, I tell him, so we're going to do it to the cars. Every time, I'm going to chop it, brother. We're going to do it. You know what I say? Yeah, man. Art, I love every time. Every time, man. You said that every time, I love it, man. You And the message I reach them, you would, man. next five years again, all of Satine and. Kings of Kingston coming yeah. out next year. Probably no, June? No, next five years. When the album comes out, you're going to sing and review it. Okay, not a problem. That's the next interview I'm going to do. Reviewing the King of Kingston not album. Not a problem. Sometime brother, brother. Soon next year. Godfather. <laughs> Why, Come lad? Teach them. Get Find them in the message. Reach them. <laughs> King of Kingston. I want to them reach them. Yeah. Brother, brother. Give thanks. Yeah, wow. man, the King of Kingston, it's finalizing, coming out good. We're going to have some really good track. And then the most important thing is the sound of the album I want people to pay attention to. Not mm. just the songs, the oh, sound. Because most of the album will come out now. If you take off the words and the vocals, I'm no playing on the Jamaica music, that. Mm. 
that type problem with me have with them. Take off the vocal, play that. That's Jamaica music. You're not making dance all album. You can't make dance all album and no dance all. Uh, music no depend on it. Because the, the patwa and no dance all music, no one your instrumental that says Jamaica. The music fair speak Jamaica too. And that with them now, though, them now pay attention to the sound. Anytime, if you have host music start sound like hip hop, host not there again. And then we have dancehall start sound like trap. That means the dancehall not there again, virgin. This is a reggae tongue not change up sound yet, you know? No. I see him thing them are using. And reggae tongue, big same way. So I don't understand what Jamaica people are doing. Say Afro. Come and uh, Afro, I take one part of the world because they have a sound. Them stay consistent. Consistency is our problem. We try everything. Every little thing coming sound good to we. We confuse that Jamaican people are confuse the music. But there is a format that accepted. Look on it. Just watch what Shaggy and Sean Paul use. You, you, all right, look at Spice. Don't go down there. Are the biggest thing that I roll right now here? Longest while me see a dance hall song for the international scene. A Spice song over there. All of them look like idiot away from them chop chop the whole them not over there. Oh, we not hear none of them. <laughs> them chop, man. Them in our box. <laughs> Rat chop. <laughs> Yeah, man, boy, it was a great vibe, man. We like it, man. Let's go and do the work, brother, brother. We are look forward to the album. Yeah, exactly. And see, come. I know enough people out there look forward. And when the people them see this, they can't allow me alone now. People yeah, they can't. Stop stressing out the youth. <laughs> Every day, man. Every yeah, man. man. Day. But you know, so you have your page at them. You have your real loyal fans and them really look up to you. And them know the connection. So yeah, them man. know, say, yo, this did have to come. Mm. But you know, we save the best for last. All right, so... <laughs> This is how we close, you know, 2021. Man. Brother, brother. Teach you know, them! You know, me now ask for DJ from your start. Give me a piece of one general, no man. You know, one general there, <laughs> man. I want to teach them in the land. 1972, we see the of a great color, look, bed with a tan. See, view the time, the place. Drop the first hit song, the age of 21. Kappa shot it, did the bang, but dub, fit up, was the bomb. Now the world start here, we. Music start, peer, we. Radio start, play, we. New girl start, heal, we. Say, now come, peer, me. I'm on another level, go and go circle around the teeth. Say, Uncle T, and jam me, then we tell you. One day, I'm not in Man. If I dance, I'll have be without the killer. Salud. Teach them! Always make sure the message I reach them! Teach them! Hey yo, yellow! Send the message and make it reach them. It's teach them right here. Warlord representing.